everyone and welcome back to my channel. So if you are joining me today, then you obviously want to be updated on my pregnancy. So today I'm going to be filling you guys in on my 12 to 16 week pregnancy update. Kind of getting you up to date on where I am at right now. And I'm just so excited to be able to finally share this with you guys. You don't understand how sad it's made me that you guys just didn't know. Anyways, let's get started on the update. under my pre-pregnancy weight. I don't know, it's, it's bad, but it's not like super bad because it's not like I'm a skinny mini person. Anyways, I probably could have lost the 12 pounds, but right now, as I said in my last update, I am on Diclectin because I was having really bad nausea and wasn't able to eat. So far, that's been helping really well. I take it once in the morning and once at night, and it helps a lot. I still have to make sure my meals are quite small, or else if I eat too much, I will start to feel sick. So I eat about five small meals a day instead of eating three big meals a day. I'm just starting to be able to drink some hot drinks. I really like tea and decaffeinated coffee, so I'll maybe drink it every three days. I'll have, be able to have a cup, and I'm not getting as turned off like I was before. Last time before that, I was so, so, so sick anytime the, a hot drink would touch my lips, so that is good. Oh, this is something I didn't update in my last update, but I am peeing all the time. I don't know why. I thought that with Caden, this didn't really happen until I was more farther along and showing, but still, I'm peeing at least once in the middle of the night, sometimes two times, and I'm peeing all the time during the day. I don't know, is that normal? Like, I just feel like that didn't happen till later on in my pregnancy with Kaden. So I don't know if that's because it's my second pregnancy or maybe I just don't remember it happening in my with my pregnancy with Kaden. But I just find myself, I have a tiny bladder. My face has been clearing up really well. It's now at its normal state. It's not so broken out and bad. Of course, as you know, I have acne, so my face is never going to be perfect. I do still have breakouts, but I'm more at what I'm normally at and not at like a crazy bad breakout, which is good. So I think my hormones are starting to adjust and my skin is returning back to its normal state. Yay. Maybe it will get better. I felt, oh, Caden, my skin was better than it's ever been. So fingers crossed that that will happen with this pregnancy as well. I have really felt... Hi. started to crave sweets like baking or cinnamon yeah, yeah. Toast, cinnamon bread I'm really trying to stay away yeah, from too yeah. many sweets because obviously too much sweets isn't good for you but I do like to treat myself every once in a while and that is definitely a craving as of right now is my sweets Kane's trying to give you kisses <laughs> I feel like the point I'm at right now is probably the worst point for being pregnant I feel like I don't look pregnant, but I have a gut. So I feel pudgy and I feel fat, which isn't fun. I just wish I'd get to that point where people would be like, oh, that girl's pregnant, not oh. Oh, that girl ate a few too many burritos. That's what I feel like right now. So anytime now my belly can pop and look like a baby and not like a pudgy gut. I'll show you guys my belly at the end of this update. And the last thing, like, I'm at the point where there's not too much happening in my pregnancy, wow. but I have started to feel flutters at night. Now, I'm not sure that could be gas, but I feel like wow. it, could be, it could be baby inside me, maybe doing a little kicks. I've started to wow. feel flutters. Um, I know when I've been at the doctors and they've looked for their heartbeat, there has been kicks, and I haven't been able to feel those kicks when he's looking, but I feel like I feel flat. I'm starting to feel flutters. I feel like it's baby. It's either baby or I'm getting really bad gas. So I don't know. But anyways, I know this video, this um, update is a lot shorter and sweeter, but I just feel like there's not as much to update on right now because I'm so early on, but I will show you my belly, and I will start updating a weekly. Um, yeah, because my 17 week update will be a little late because I'll be coming back from holidays, but I will make sure I have one up. If not, my 17 and 18 will be combined, and then the rest will be going weekly from then on. Anyways, this is my belly. I don't know if you can see. I just feel like right now I'm wearing like Lululemon, so they're up high. So they probably like 
conceal my pudge. I just don't look pregnant. I look, that's just my pudginess, but yeah, I feel like I just look flabby. Anytime now, Bella, you can pop, anytime. Yeah, so that's the Bella. So yeah, that is it. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already, because I promise I usually do put a video every single week. And now that I'm back and I'm feeling better, I will be, because I usually stick to that schedule. I love you guys for moving I'm back. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye.